Hi guys, today I'm going to demonstrate a new feature in the Your Dino data acquisition system. And the feature is that you can cut parts of the graph. Now here we have an example that looks a bit strange. As you can see, something is going on here. Uh, this is a test we did with a Mercurizer diesel engine, and it did, it did this in all the runs, so something is strange with that uh, engine, but I'm going to use this as an uh, example to show you how we can uh, trim parts of the graph that you want to get rid of. Of course, if this is not a real issue, you don't want to show a graph like this to your customer. You want to, it to look a bit more smooth than that. And um, I'll show you how to do that. If you right click, you will have a new option now called Edit Graph. So you can click this uh, option and you will get this help button or help message. Cut parts of the graph by holding the control key and click drag the mouse over the area you want to cut. Uh, so well, let's do that. Um, if we hold the control key, you see a scissors uh, symbol is coming up, so we can do that. And uh, then just find exactly the area we want to get rid of and let go, and then, then it's gone. This particular run had a little bit of an issue also here. You almost cannot see it, but you'll see it if I zoom in. And you see there is a kind of a loop here. Now this happens if the if the RPM doesn't increase all the time. If it increases a bit and then decreases again and increases, then a, a loop like this happens. It's a bit annoying and you can get rid of them also easily, just holding the control key and you do that. So now the graph looks quite a bit better. In addition, of course, you can uh, trim if you have some crap going on here in the beginning, or beginning of the run. This happens sometimes so when the break is settling in. You can uh, get rid of that, or maybe you want to get rid of uh, something at the end. Um, you can change the visibility of the graphs uh, so that uh, you, on, you will only cut the visible graph. So let's say now we have uh, removed uh, the torque curve. So you only see the, the horsepower curve. You can say I want to get, uh, oops, I want to get uh, this part of uh, the curve trimmed, for example. You do that, and you will see that. Um, Horsepower got changed, but the the torque is uh, is the same. Of course, this is the same as you know if you if you have the if you don't cover uh, the uh, the horsepower graph with your rectangle, it's also not going to be affected. But sometimes you know if they cross and you only want to trim one of them, you will uh, put one to visible and the other to hidden, and then you can only trim one of them. Okay, that's all I wanted to uh, show you. I hope you like the new feature.